Hello and welcome to Drugs Plus. Whether you're here for exam revision or just general interest, I hope you find this video useful. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to support this channel so I'm able to continue creating this content. In this video, I'm going to discuss the hormone vasopressin, also known as antidiuretic hormone. Vasopressin is one of the two main neuroendocrine hormones released by the posterior pituitary gland. Vasopressin is actually synthesized in the hypothalamus and then sent down neurons that directly project to the posterior pituitary. When the blood is low in water content, i.e. when you're thirsty, it secretes vasopressin into the bloodstream where it is delivered to the kidneys. Here, vasopressin acts on vasopressin receptor 2 molecules on cells of the proximal tubules and collecting ducts, causing them to express aquaporin 2 molecules on their cell surfaces. This allows water to become reabsorbed at these sections of the neuron rather than getting excreted as urine, preventing water loss when thirsty. When quenched, however, the hypothalamus senses a high water concentration in the blood and does not release vasopressin, meaning aquaporins do not get inserted into the nephron, meaning more water is excreted as urine, a homeostatic mechanism. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it useful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to support this channel so I'm able to continue creating this content. I'll be back with more pharmacology videos soon.